This is an overview of GW3D Features Solid Multi-Tube UV Feature. This is the 2D sketch which represents the box or area which bounds the 3D curves. The 3D curves will be mapped to the surface based on the box edges. The box edges represent the left and right, top and bottom of the surface, but in 2D space. The 3D sketches represent the curves that are going to be mapped onto the surface. They can lie on the surface or move up and down in the Z, which will then translate to in and out of the surface. So let's look at the surface and see that it is applicable for UV mapping. This is not a surface of revolution. This is a dome surface. It has four sides and thusly the interior has nice UV flow lines. This should map nicely. So now we can apply the 3D curves to the surface. Starting easy, in each of the 3D sketches there is only one spline which is active. The rest are construction. This gives us an opportunity to make sure that the setup is working correctly. Everything looks pretty good at this point. So we can go ahead and accept this feature. Let's go back to the 3D sketch and change from construction to regular geometry. When we exit the sketch, that should add these curves as solids to the surface. Everything appears good. Proceed to the next sketch and follow the same procedure.